So as some of you may know, DPSS serves as a major safety net for our county's most vulnerable um, residents. Our department administers federal, state, and county funded programs for people in need of healthcare coverage, nutritional benefits, cash benefits, and helping people prepare, prepare for and um, find employment. We provide these services to more than 3.7 million people who live in LA County, and that includes over 1.1 million children. We're the county's largest public social services department, and we're the county's third largest um, department. Right now, we understand that families who were struggling prior to the pandemic have been hit especially hard. So helping them with their needs, like healthcare coverage, has become really critical. Um, Medi-Cal is the name of the federally funded Medicaid program that operates in California. Medi-Cal provides healthcare coverage to families and individuals with limited income and resources. Now, in other words, that really just means that this Medi-Cal offers free or low cost healthcare coverage to those who are unable to afford the cost of medical care. As of November, we have provided healthcare access to over 3.2 million county residents. This is Medi-Cal alone, not our other benefits and services, it's Medi-Cal alone. Medi-Cal benefits include outpatient services, emergency services, hospitalization, maternity and newborn care, preventative and wellness care, chronic disease management, mental health and substance um, use disorder services, prescription services, and dental services. Um, qualified immigrants such as legal permanent residents may be eligible for full scope Medi-Cal our undocumented immigrant population may be eligible to restricted scope or limited scope um, Medi-Cal benefits. And um, some recent changes brought about by Senate bill changes allow for the provision of full scope Medi-Cal um, to a certain population regardless of immigration status. And those are all children under the age of 19 and young adults age 19 to 25. Now, because of the pandemic, we realized that there are a record number of people who have become unemployed or have had their wages decreased because of working less hours. And because of this, they may have lost their healthcare coverage um, from their employers. Medi-Cal may be an option that they never considered before now. And although our department has been around for decades, we can't assume that everyone knows what we offer or how to connect with us. So we've expanded our outreach and marketing efforts. We have bus shelter ads throughout the county letting um, residents know of the availability of Medi-Cal for health coverage needs and how to connect with us. Um, we've partnered with the city of LA to place signage at the COVID testing sites with information how DPSS can help with health coverage needs um, and we, push out information on our social media platforms of what's available, what's upcoming, and what may have changed. Um, I encourage you um, to follow us on our social media pages if you don't already. Um, we push out, like I said, timely and updated information on the programs and services we have and um, our hours of operation. We're looking for, for all ways of letting the community know that we're here for them. Um, now, as a safety measure and as a result of the pandemic, we've had to close the doors of our brick and mortar offices. But our um, incredible staff um, remain committed to providing the same level of service um, via the telephone to our county residents. Um, and to be more available, we've actually extended the hours of our customer service call centers. Um, we're open Monday through Friday, 7.30 a.m. to 7.30 p.m. And now we're open on Saturdays from 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Um, if the callers call, they can get information about all of our programs. They can apply for benefits over the phone. Um, the 
and with the um, executive orders that have been signed by our governor, a lot of the documentation that they would have otherwise had to bring to us in person or mail to us, we can take it or accept it over the phone or accept um, an affidavit. Our call agents speak up to 10 languages um, and they're able to provide um, an assistance in other languages by the use of a language landline. So um, residents can call us 24, day, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, visit by visit, I'm sorry, folks can apply 24 hours a day by visiting our website at dpss.lacounty.gov. Um, again, we want to let the community know that we're here for them and we're committed to helping them. And I encourage all of you to stay connected with us. Invite us back to these calls, to these um, round tables, and we will continue to share information. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Ms. Sheetam. Um, we have some questions for you. Uh, first of all, let me ask you, what is the least known, what is less known about uh, Medi-Cal? Is there, is there something that people don't know that you want them to know? That Medi-Cal is one program name, but there are many programs within that umbrella, under that umbrella that folks may qualify for. Um, and for example, um, you may not be eligible to one of our other cash benefit programs because you're receiving SSI, but you're, there's portions of uh, Medi-Cal that you may qualify um, for even though you're getting part A and part B of Medicare. So don't assume that you may not qualify, apply. There are very, there are uh, many available options that are open. We just need you to apply and we'll walk through them with you so we can find a program that meets your needs. 